Hey guys, this is Ty Traverse, and welcome to Super Continent LTD. It's a game where basically you're on the phone the whole time. At least that's what I think it said. Brandies, do you copy? <laughs> yes, I'm inside Ferguson's office. Great job. Now, Proxima wants you to gather all the intel possible on Supercontinent LTD Executive Board. Look for a computer or a data terminal and connect yourself to it. Okay. Uh, what's the matter? This guy doesn't own a computer. Maybe this? What do you see? A device I've never encountered before. I'm sending you some images. Holy shit, that's a landline telephone. <laughs> Who has those? I heard some underground groups still use them because they're so obsolete we hackers don't have a tool to hack them. And they're right. Don't panic. I'll look for a manual online and tell you how to proceed. We will get this. We still got this. Okay, I'll get comfortable then. Super continent LTD. Nice! I look. <laughs> I'm just all like futuristic like. Oh yeah. What the heck's on the back of my head? There's like a plug on the back. That's weird. Am I using it right? According to the manual, yes. <laughs> the top hole is the earphone, and you're supposed to speak through the lower one. So this is some sort of communication device. Exactly, you have to input an address using the numpad keys or number keys on your keyboard. Shut up, phone. When you, you enter nine digits, it'll automatically try to connect you with that address. They've never used a landline phone. Have they never used a phone? Is everything digital these days? Cool, is that it? Yeah, if you mistake a digit, you can reset by pressing the backspace on your keyboard. So I'm gonna have to speak through, speak with some fellas. Luckily, I brought with me my Beaumont, which, with which I can impersonate any voice if I have enough data. I brought Adrian Ferguson's voice installed on it. Why did you brought that? Bring that. Just in case there was some voice protective devices. I'm a professional. I like to make it worth my time and money. Proxima is very proud of you, Brandies. So, what number do I call? I've checked the city's central phone system and there's nothing online about supercontinent LTD landline addresses. What? More bad news? Tonight, at 2 a.m., our historical landline network will be disconnected permanently due to lack of use. Thank you very much to the last romantics who have been sending love and hope through these old systems. Central phone system. We're just cutting all landlines. No landlines. No, 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 no. We're done. That's in a few hours. So this is a one-shot operation against the clock, huh? No problem. I got this. Okay, I'll take a look around and see what I can get. Okay, um... Address book? What the heck? I make things float. It's a phone directory. But all the pages have been torn off. How about this one? I got the force! Looks like a note from Ferguson's secretary. It says, your wife called. I hope you didn't forget the number again. 555-693-030. It may come in handy. I got one number! What do we got over here? I just love that he has the voice. He's like, Bow. Best Chief Financial Officer, 2101. It looks heavy. This can be 
drone at high speed. That was a weird thought. Okay. Oh, what do we got here? A calendar from Supercontinent LTD. Supercontinent LTD technical office for VIP clients. 555. Yeah, we got the tech office now. 555-464-032. I can dig this. Okay, is that what we got going for us right now? Looks like it. Okay. Adrian Ferguson. Brandy's. Do I, do I have to figure out these people? Okay. Uh, you need anything? Any ideas? Damn, Brandy, we're the one who hired something. Even by that having new information may open new paths in a conversation you've already tried. Be like a good salesman, be persistent. Also remember that I can give you intel backup. If you have any leads on something, you can like You need anything? No, that's it. Okay, so he's basically my help guy now. Nice, good luck. Here we go. Okay, how do I start this? Do I just... Five 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 four six four zero three two. Five 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 four six four zero three two. Here we go. Pick up the phone already. You called Superintendent LTD Technical Office. Please clearly pronounce your client's security word. Admin 1234? I'm sorry, that key doesn't exist in our database. Have a good day. Okay, so the tech office needs a password. Okay, so I think we have to use this and call... Okay, blah, 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 blah. What do we got? Your wife called. I hope you don't forget the number again. 555... So, 555-693-0302. Five 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 six nine three zero three zero. Okay, here we go. Second call. Calling my wife, or his wife, not my wife. I'm trying to hack the system and steal all their info. Hello? Shit, that's Adrian Ferguson's voice. Is he home? Better hang up. I can't use his own voice with him. Okay, so we have his we have his home phone. Um Okay, what does this say? Five 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 six six seven three three one. I'll try that one. Five 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 six six seven three three one. Five 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 six three seven three three one. Five 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 six three seven three three one. I have no clue what I'm doing. I think that's a good number though. Let's paste it on the wall backwards. The number you're calling isn't operated anymore. It won't ever. Is that a. What, what number would that be then? 558? Is that 558? Oh, it's 555-997. 997-331. Okay. Five 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 nine nine seven three three. How about that one? All of them seem to be five 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 numbers, so that's why I think this is a five. But it may not be. It might be an eight. You decided? Decided on what? Don't play, fool. Or your wife is done for, Ferguson. No wait. What do you want? I said terms are non-negotiable. Postpone Operation CSJ. If a single cop dies tonight, your wife will die too. What, is, what does CSJ stand for? Enough games, Mr. Ferguson. You have until midnight. 
Okay, so that's the kidnapper's phone number. Ooh, what do we got? What, what info do we know? So we got these three numbers. Uh, title chief. Okay, I think. Have you guys? I. It's been a long time since I've used a landline phone like this. Most of the time they're just in office buildings now. Most people use cell phones these days. Decided on what? Don't play. Okay, okay. Blah, 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 blah. What do you want? I said I turned it non negotiable. Postpone operations, CSA, blah, 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 blah. Did you say postpone, not abort? Exactly. I'm all for a super cause. But CSJ can't happen tonight. Why? I have family inside the police department. I want to make sure I can keep them safe before it all begins. But you won't listen. I'm sorry, but this is a this is bigger than us. Why are you doing this? I swear I to you, I am loyal to Supercontinent's cause. In fact, I'm planning on supporting the cause even if you are after my head. But simply, I cannot let CSJ happen tonight. It has to be postponed. Who are you? Come again? Are you in shock? You'll forgive me, but we executives have a hard time remembering non-executive people. Yeah, sure. My kidnappers, of they kidnapped my wife. I don't remember who they are. Who knows? I'm Barbara, one of Supercontinent's enforcers. Mission update, Barbara, enforcer. Barbara who? Listen, I don't care for your incompetence. Do as I said or kiss your wife goodbye. Well, Barbara, calm down. Like, okay, I think I have enough info. Can I be Barbara now? Back to being Brandy's. Um, I'm gonna call call the house. Let's call the house. Let's call the house. See if I can talk to Ferguson. Five 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 six nine three zero three. Five 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 six nine three zero three. This game is really in interesting. Like I've never had to use the keypad for anything, and the fact that I have to call all these numbers to try to piece together this story. We're gonna we're gonna get through this, guys. Hello? Hmm. That's Andrea and Ferguson's voice. Looks like this is his phone number. I'll use Vmod to simulate a random voice so I can call him as many times as necessary. from Supercontinent LTD for security reasons. We're updating clients' passwords. Is that true? And who am I speaking with? This is Lucius Leipzig, starter, started as IT a couple of weeks ago, sir. Nice, listen, Lucas, if you're truly working for us, consider your fire for trying to steal my password. It's okay, sir, that was a test. We're checking if our company members have been well instructed. I guess you passed. Have a good night. Well, that didn't go according to plan. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna try that one more time and do something a little bit. I wonder how many of these phone numbers I'm gonna memorize. So we have our kidnappers who stole the wife. Barbara is somebody really. Right Hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know it's his voice. I'll use Vmod to send me that random voice so I can call him as many times as necessary. I'm calling from city blah blah, yeah. Hello, Mr. Ferguson, how are you? I'm calling from the city's central phone. System. Oh yeah? What's the matter? As you know, service will be discontinued in a few hours. We're offering a free of charge service to retrieve all the obsolete equipment. Who 
do I have to speak with to get a directory of supercontinents installed landlines? Don't worry about it. We'll handle our own equipment, thank you. Wait, but... Well then! Mr. Ferguson's a little bitch. I don't know what to do, guys. We're gonna call Vegas. What? Oh, okay, so that's why you have Vega. What can you find out on Barbara? Any other useful data? She's supposed to be an enforcer at Supercontinent LTD. Okay, let me check. Take note, Barbara Lang, 26, enforcer at Superintendent LTD, as you said. Nice! Success. We have figured out a new person. So we've been working there for three years. Ascending quickly up the ranks. The police department has an extensive file on her and wow what she's related to the chief of the homicide division she's her daughter and she's working for a criminal corporation good in any case look if if you can find any medical data on her that way i'll be able to impersonate her with the Vima. on it gotcha transmitting data fantastic there you go you need anything that's it. Thank you, Vega. Okay, so now we have... Now we have Barbara Lang. Okay, now we have Barbara Lang. I'm gonna impersonate her and call... Um, call Ferguson. And, which, in doing so, we might be able to get this password out of him. Yeah, 555-693. Five 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 six nine three zero three. Hopefully, we can scare Mr. Ferguson into giving us the info we need so that we can get into the system. That would be nice. Hello? So you decided? Sorry, Barbara. You know we've been planning CSJ for years. We can't simply let this go. What does CSJ exactly consist of? We can't go over the details all over again, Barbara. This is our best chance at bringing down the oppressive power the police have been putting all of us through since the city's new Burlock. And CSJ doesn't mean that every policeman will die tonight. I trust on people's judgment, the most likely to fall will be the corrupted ones. Your father's got nothing to fear. I want to detail profile the company's executive. Shit, Barbara, I can't agree to that even with my wife's life on the line. If I sell out the company like that, we all die. Me, my wife, you, your dad. Okay, I get it. Um, tell me your password. This is what we need. Tell me your password and I'll spare your wife. My password, you say? Yes, the one for Supercontinent's technical office for VIP clients. But that's not an actual... I know, but if you won't... Oh, yeah. I know, but you won't save my father's life. At least give me a chance of doing so. Your wife will get to live and I'll make it look like it broke into your office and stole your password. Yeah, but what, your wife's life is not even worth a little shame on your f for accidentally leaking a password? Alright, you win. The password is Pangea. Pangea? How romantic. Your wife will be delivered safely to your home tomorrow morning. I also recommend you to unplug this line from the network. Why? I don't want you plotting with your colleagues. I'll be calling every now and then to check in, check if the phone is online. If I hear a single tone, your wife is dead. Are we clear? Understood. Have a good night. That's how we do it! Okay, so now I can be Ferguson and call the technical support. Which is 555 4640 
Yeah, three, two. Here we go. We're progressing. We got this. I don't know how long this game's gonna go, but hopefully we'll get through it. You can call Supercon and LCD Technical Office. Please clearly pronounce your client security password. Pangea. Connecting with Supercon and CTO office, please wait. Wow, this is so slow. Their connection must be like 20 megs. Connected. Francis speaking. Who's this? Hey, Francis. So we have Francis, the CTO. I'll see SJ coming along. On track, I guess. Why? Are you nervous? I'd lie if I said no. Who came up with the name, by the way? The boss, probably. But hey, you can't... You can't, it isn't cool. Civil, simple, justice. It's nice, yeah, but why simple? Shit, Adrian. I hope you're not trying to change it again. We're on the verge of consummating the plan. Yeah, but still, simple? Listen, it's simple because it puts the power back where it belongs, on the people. The city's burlock was the straw that breaks the camel. The obnoxious current justice system is just a device to control us. Anarchy! Anarchy! The poor are just devoured by it, and the powerful not only aren't affected by it, it protects them. For fuck's sake, nowadays you can even pay to postpone the date of a trial. What is that? You know we've been trying to help the mid-low class with supercontinent's economic muscle. But there's just too... There's just not enough money to pay the way out of the system for everybody. That's why tonight we're gonna break it. Civil unrest is at the verge of a riot outburst. We're just going to light the fuse so we can finally bring down the enforcers of this unjust system. The police. Ugh. I can't wait to witness the night trials tonight. People are executing sentences based on the civil pen penalty manifesto we all defined four years on the deep web. Night trials, civil penalty manifesto. Well, I'm all for it, but I gotta say, it doesn't sound all that democratic. Having almost 30% of the city population take part in it sounds representative enough for me. Yeah, you're right, Francis. Can you give me our CEO's number? I need to make a con consultation about tonight's operation. You know Randahika doesn't own a landline? Don't be hasty, Andrew. She will call you after we detonate the bombs. Okay, we're bombing the police station, apparently. Alright. Where are the bombs going off? Where are the bombs going off? I believe Clyde is managing that. Alright, sorry. Do you have his number at hand? Don't you have it on your phone book? No, I'm very sorry, it just, I destroyed it just to be sure, you know, being the last night for the landline. Oh fuck, <laughs> yeah, I forgot how you went paranoid on the last meeting and tore all the pages from it. Pretty dramatic. Cut it, Francis. <laughs> sorry man, Clyde's number is 555-677-623. Yes, we got a new number, that's beautiful. Okay, so Clyde knows that. I better get back. I better go back to work. Take care. Okay, we got a lot of good info. We're gonna call, uh, switch back over to him so that Vega doesn't go crazy. Need anything? Uh, what can you find out on Clyde? Yeah. Super kind of LDD Clyde. I don't need to do a search for that. He's pretty famous. Oh, yeah. I don't have the plush. Clyde. Schumacher, 45, Enforcer. He's some sort of hack of all trades, hitman, transporter, cleaner, and a demolition expert. 
Sounds like a good friend to count in a situation. Yeah, but be careful with him. He's really short-tempered. Gotcha. What about the VMOD data? I'm sorry, Clyde is a ghost for the system. He doesn't have any medical records to hack. You have to do it without impersonating him. Okay, thank you. You need anything? That's all. Good luck. Woo! Is there a way to... Oh. Okay, so we got Clyde, it's Vincent Data to impersonate, Barbara, Francis, Radecki, two others. Okay, let's let's call let's call Clyde. 555-677-623. Here we go. Time to call the muscle. Hopefully we can get some good good things going. Hey. Hi Clyde, I'm Adrian. About the bombs. When are you going to detonate them? You tell me, we've been waiting for you to send us the codes for ages. What happened to your home line? Were you supposed to be there? It broke down. I came to the office as soon as I could when I found out. Okay, give me the codes. Oh shit, I'm very, very sorry. I completely forgot about them. Are you fucking kidding me? We're in the middle of a shitstorm here. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm having a terrible night. My wife has been kidnapped. Are you serious? Man, I don't want to sound insensitive. Pay the ransom or whatever, but we need the fucking codes. Shit, Clyde, you are heartless. Well, he is the hippie. But where are the codes supposed to be? I swear I'm gonna punch you in the face when this is over. The codes are on your phone, safe, locked in your office. How do I access it? Listen, Adrian, I can't have you losing your mind here. Not tonight. Input your fucking code in the very phone you're using to speak with me. And what was the code? I cannot fucking believe it, Adrian. How should I know? Fuck! <sighs> okay, okay, calm down. I'll ask Francis. Let's see. You're going to pay for this. Call me as soon as you get those fucking codes. Whoop, I guess we're talking to Francis! 555-464-032 Francis, baby, speak to me! I need to know these codes, because I am an idiot and can't remember a damn thing apparently. Francis speaking, who's this? Hey Francis. I need access to my phone safe lock. Sure, just input the code on your phone. See, that's the thing. I, I forgot the code and I need to get it into the detonation codes. Damn it, Adrian. What's wrong with you tonight? I'm sorry. The thing is that I don't have the code either. But I do have the security question I made you record to retrieve it. Who's being extra cautious now, huh, Adrian? All right, all right, Francis, you were right. What was the question then? Here we go. The year of the first Rio Olympics followed by my wife's date of birth. Okay. And when was your wife? Not my wife, yours, dumbass. I was kidding. I got it. Yes, thank you. Okay, I need to figure out my wife's state of birth, so I need to be you, let's call Vega, here we go. Need anything? Okay, what? Okay. Guess I gotta be Ferguson and call Barbara? Because Barbara would have my wife with me, no stop it. Okay, so 555-997-3-2-1. 555 Wife's date of birth. I hope I can figure that out. Give me good news. I almost have it sorted out, Francis, and the rest are almost convinced. 
But before proceeding any further, I ha I want to make sure this is all worth. It. Is my wife okay? As long as you meet your end of the deal, yes. I need to be sure. Can I ask her something? What is it? I want her to tell me her birthday. She'll know. Her birthday? Please, this is important. Oh Christ. Okay, give me a sec. Second of November, 2075. So second November. So two. Oh, I gotta write all this down. I'm s okay, here we go. Two November 11. 2075. Okay. 211, 2075. Thank you. Bye. Okay. So the Rio Olympics. Here we go. Olympics, Olympics. Best Chief Financial Officer 221. Oh, it looks heavy. Okay. Mom, please work. Yes! Finally! I tried so many different things. Okay. What's this? Zero 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 five 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 zero eight. So I can set up a bomb. Calling to this number. Okay, zero 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 five 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 zero eight. See what happens. Satellite pulse bomb launcher active. Insert coordinates for the deployment. Shit, this is some serious technology we're talking. World War Three band stuff here. I'm afraid this is the end of the line, Brandis. Excuse me? I'm sorry, beauty. We truly are professional, but Proxima only hired you to get the access code to this little toy. What? A freelancer's life really sucks, huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. You know this business. No hard feelings. It's all yours, Detective Bushida. What? Keep him in check while I download all the useful data from his brain drive with my neural disruptor. Fuck me if I don't hate neural disruptors. They're just so unethical. I'm sorry, Vega, you know how a freelancer life works. Click. Call Centaur. Connection is established. As for first, I discovered who was the Proxima Mole inside the city. Please. You know where to wire the funds. As for Superconnect LTU Orbital Bomber, that'll cost you an extra. Ah, okay. Well. The ending was a little unex unexpected. I th I was thinking that this was gonna turn into like more dilemma. You either go with the plan or go against the plan. But it even flipped that on its side and was like, oh yeah, you're just a hacker. You gotta remember that. This whole time, you're you're not part of this actual like debate whether they should blow up the thing or not blow up the thing. You were hired for a job to to hack figure out the codes and so yeah so like the ending is unexpected and very I feel like there could have been a little bit more with the ending because they were on the device it showed four other characters and I was expecting four other characters but that was Supercontinent LTD if you enjoyed this leave a like I know that using the uh, telephone and actually just typing in numbers and making phone calls is a lot different gameplay, but I enjoyed it. It was a fun time. I hated trying to get that stupid phone case because, like, I typed in everything for Rio and it was like, meh. Oh. But anyway, if you enjoyed it, leave a like, comment any games you would like me to play in the future, and I'll see you in the next adventure.
Bye guys.